On an automated gearbox, you have a gear selector that can be moved in three directions. It has two rings. Rotate the center ring to D, drive, and the gearbox engages the starting ratio in automatic mode. You're ready to go. Rotate it to N and the gearbox shifts into neutral. Move the second ring to C to crawler mode. The gearbox now engages the lowest forward gear and shifts into manual mode. Move the ring to R, reverse, the gearbox engages the first reverse gear and shifts into manual mode. Access reverse gears R1, R2 and R3 by moving the stalk up or down parallel to the steering wheel, following the plus and minus signs. Careful, in mode R3 the vehicle must be stationary for this gear to engage. It can cause premature clutch wear. To resume forward drive in automatic mode, simply push the selector once towards you, as you would to flash your headlights. You can also call up the rocking mode by moving the C and R ring. Releasing the accelerator will make the vehicle rock back and forth to free yourself from a sticky situation. To shift from automatic to permanent manual mode or vice versa, push the stalk as you would to flash your headlights. Adjust the gears by moving the stalk up or down, parallel to the steering wheel. If you want to adjust the automatic driving mode by shifting to higher gears, move the stalk up parallel to the steering wheel. If you're in automatic mode and you change gear, a temporary manual mode is activated. Automatic mode is reactivated as soon as you accelerate, when you pull the stalk towards you, moving it as for headlight flashing, or if the vehicle is stationary. Start line. The keys to a winning start.